Alright guys, we are back for another Dokkan Battle video. This is a character that I feel like people would probably like to see um, a, a solid attempt at this guy performing in this first form cell fight. Um, now, I, I don't think he'll do spectacularly. I, I think that is it's just like a start of turn defense. It's just not going to be enough probably in this fight, but we'll see. Right, we can run him on Yamcha's team. Yamcha's one of the best characters in the game for this fight. Uh, my idea would be LR Super Saiyan 4 Goku slot 1, and then Namek Goku slot 2. Uh, exactly like that. Yeah, yep, perfect. <laughs> yep, that's yep. That's, uh, that's what we're looking for right there, actually. Awesome, awesome. Uh, now, there is a little bit of an issue here, and that's that Yamcha could do a little bit too much. So, let's hope that Yamcha doesn't do that. Um, I actually wish we had more orbs for Bulma. It's fine. Now, for Namek Goku, I kind of want to clear these in orbs out of here. We do not want Namek Goku um, getting the 18 key. It will do us no good in here. Dodge it? No, he ate it. Okay. Uh, now, we have a very high amount of HP. One thing to remember, Yamcha and Yajirobe specifically... Um, are TUR characters where Dokkan understood the assignment. Now, what I'm talking about specifically is their HP stat. Remember, uh, of the three stats, characters have HP, attack, and defense. Dodge it, baby. No, she ate it. Okay. Uh, we're off to a bad start, but it's okay. It's okay. Um, of the three major stats, HP is the only one that really matters. Attack and defense are going to be completely, you know, formulated by uh, passive abilities super attack effects links anyway right so that you could have a 5,000 attack stat and be the hardest hitting unit in the game right like they could just do it um hp is what's really really important uh yamcha and yadrobi as tur characters were giving tremendously high hp pools which just works very well for them wow we, we took a lot of damage man oh boy that's that's not good that is not good yeah, he, I mean, he's at 200k. That's just, that's so low. That's, that's, that's very, very low for us. All right, we're going to want to try and get Kid Goku as many orbs as possible. That's going to be pretty big. Um, oh. Okay, let's hit this. And then Kid Goku has, okay, okay, okay. So, I mean, this will be a little bit of extra juice for Namek Goku. This is great, right? We have, I mean, really the only link that truly matters for Namek Goku, which is prepare for battle, which is defense. I mean, the rest of it is all just attack. We're going to get the damage reduction support from Kid Goku. We have Bulma support up. Yajirobe support we don't have up. Um, okay, okay. Oh, Cell did not super attack right away. That's really good for us. Super Saiyan 4 Goku getting hit or dodging it. Um, and then supering. He's not taking nothing from this guy. Super right here. Oh, no. No way. Uh, my Namek Goku is not built full dodge. So, uh, we'll see. He could trip. If he triple supers, could he double digit tank? <laughs> well. 495? I mean, it's not the worst ever. I mean, I guess if we factor in his age, he's, you know, two years old. Uh, we did have Kid Goku support. We did have Bulma support. That was only one super. Um, I mean, obviously, that's not great. But, I mean, that 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 run was just pretty, like, sour, all things considered. That was a pretty sour run. Let's hop, right, let's hop back in. <laughs> oh, boy. It's going to be one of these videos. And that dude, that, look at that dreadful second turn. What, I mean, what do I do? What do we do? What do we do here? Uh, wool. Damn. I, this was so bad. Like, it, it's, it, it actually just could not be worse. We, we actually got perfectly bad rotations. Like, it, it's the absolute worst possible. Like, there, there's no conceivable way the rotations could have been worse right here. Damn it. I, I, this is the part where I would cut, but again, we're, we're very, like, when I was doing the Omega videos, you know, you guys can go back and check, man. They, you know, those are like, a lot of those are like 50 minutes long. We do like 50 attempts. I make sure to get the proper footage for these characters, but, you know, here, 
it's like there are a lot of characters that I'd like to test out in like a new really. T this will be easy. We'll we'll tank this quite well. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Um. So, it, you know, it, it's just I, normally like I, what I'm saying is I would cut right here, but it's like you know we're kind of we're, we're we're playing as much as we can here. This this next rotation is is very sad as well. We do have Bulma support for the Yamchas. I guess I'm going to leave both Yamchas on rotation. And, I mean, we got to get Yadrobi in slot 3, man. Uh, Yadrobi, I mean, he pretty much has to be run in slot 3. Um, so, let's just hope that, like, you know, the, the Yamchas can, like, just dodge. I, I would prefer the Yamchas don't go super crazy and, like, kill this guy. Just give us normals and, and we're good. Nice dodge right there. Perfect. Okay. I could... Matter of fact, I am. I'm gonna, um, if you guys don't mind, I, I, I really would like to not go too crazy, but the little bit of extra dodge chance right here could help us. All right, see, so Yamcha doing that, that's going to get us an extra 10% chance to dodge. It's, again, not the craziest shit ever in the world, but it, you, you never know. You never know. You never know. I mean, you guys are seeing me cook these events with, you know, these, like, 25 dodge builds and stuff like that. So, that 10%. Like, it's like if the super attack comes in, you know, you no one could prove which one of the dodge procs it was that dodged it, right? Um, it, it could Because, remember, Yamcha would have... Um, his 50% passive dodge. You have whatever your hidden potential system dodges. And then Yamcha also has 10% um, for every super attack he does. So he'll, he'll typically, in a turn, he'll have three different dodge chances, right? Um, I still think they could have let Yamcha stack his, his dodge chances. Uh, that would have been pretty nice. You know, the other thing, too. This is a fight where Namek Goku's active skill could really come into play, huh? It really could. All right, dodge this baby. Oof. Okay, that's good. That's good. That's good. Uh, is Cell going to be in active skill range? I don't think so. Damn. We, we're going to have done two attempts, and I'm not... This isn't this... Oh, my God. Okay. Ow. Ow, 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 ow. Do we have it? We do. We have Yadrobi support up. If I put Bulma in slot one, we'll get the support for the active skill. Do we think that's worth it? I think so. I think so. This is Bulma's second turn. I think it's worth it. Uh, again, remember, Bulma's support kicks in when we get the orbs. If Typically, you'd run LR Super Saiyan 4 Goku in slot one. But if we put if we just throw Bulma out there like this, this is going to give Namek Goku the support for the, the frown, for his active skill. This, this could be pretty good. Okay, let's let's pop this. Let, let, let's toss this out. Namek Goku will probably kill Cell here. Probably. All right, I mean, that's... He did 9 million with that. I, I mean, I will take that. When I said Namek Goku's probably going to kill him, too, what I'm talking about is um, his super attack. But we're definitely... I, I don't think Bulma... Bulma with the two attacks is probably not going to kill him because he's going to heal. But I bet you Namek Goku will. Um, I will give him full key right here because I think he can kill Cell depending upon what happens. So we'll go for that. You know, actually... This might have turned into a pretty good run to show how Namek Goku could be pretty decent here, huh? Like, if, you know, so we came in, Namek Goku is in slot 7. So he shows up and just pops the active. 9 million crit, I mean, I'll take that. Right? Like, I mean, is Beast Gohan doing a 9 million crit turn 1? <laughs> not, not on the active. That Beast Gohan active? No, sir. No, he's not. <laughs> no, he can't do that. Uh, but Namek Goku, oh my god. Alright, if he could give us, like, two or three, he could kill. 
Okay. Wow, he did. Damn. Um... And, I mean, so we did two runs. That first run, he did die. But it wasn't, like, the worst damage ever. I mean, I, I think it, it's like, you know, I'm not like... Uh, how do I how do I word this? He's a two-year-old unit. So I think it's important to have proper expectations for his performance. And considering he's a two-year-old unit, I mean, you know, under 500k with one super. That's not bad. I I kind of feel like we got good footage here, huh? I was thinking we'd have to hop back in for one more attempt, but that kind of was good. Um, that's my last attempt for the day, too. Yeah, I, I I think we could kind of end with that. I mean, we that was that was that was a good clean run right there. Um, that's where this guy could have value. This guy, I mean, full power freeze are probably not so much since he's type disadvantage, right? But like the way their active skills are and full, it's a it's a villain, right? But this fight is tech, and then you know it, it's just the one phase. So Goku being in slot seven like that showing up right away with the active skill like that was pretty effective that was not bad at, at all okay yeah let me know what you guys thought of Namek goku but um again that was a pretty pretty decent showing by him uh even you know under 500k i mean i've seen some real hitters take more damage than that so that was not a terrible performance by Namek goku uh by any means two-year-old unit i'll take it for sure